But it looks like a bit of a weird uh, outfit, doesn't it? I've got a smart outfit and then a bit of a schoolboy thing going on. <laughs> so, on prep, so obviously you need all my all my goodies in my bag. I'll be at the table pretty much all day today, so I want to make sure I've got everything with me. But anyway, and after that, we are at the venue. Is this the start of the video? Yeah. Okay, this is the intro. So we are in York for the UK Up British Finals and uh, really, really excited for it. So we've got five guys on stage today here. We've got three in the amateurs, two in the pro show. And then we've also got someone competing in PCA today. So it's going to be an action-packed day, plus I'm judging. George is going to get all the videos for everyone on the team. Yeah. But everyone's set. Everyone has their game plan all laid out. They've got when they're going to have their meal times, when they're going to be on stage, when they're going to be going backstage. Everything's all planned. We're going to meet some of them now. Some of them are getting a tan and makeup done. So the ones that are free, we're going to do uh, in-person check-ins, make sure they're all happy. It's now half past ten. The show doesn't start until twelve. So we've got plenty of time to check on them later, make sure everyone's happy before the day begins. But yeah, British finals is always a good day. We competed here four years ago, right? Yeah, the exact venue. Exact same first, venue. My first ever show. Show season. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so we got good memories here. So yeah, we're gonna get inside and start the day. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come here. You're up there with the face. 
I like how coordinated it is.
Oh, it's coming out at the angles.
doing your hair though. Welcome back to the channel. It's been a few days. Um, I thought I'd do the outro in the garden for a change, just to mix it up a little bit. So I hope the audio is all okay. So it is now Friday on the following week. Sorry, it's a Saturday and you'll notice that I've got a tan on and that's because I'm competing tomorrow. It's actually gonna be like a bit of a secret show, but by the time this comes out, which will be tomorrow, I'll be getting on stage. So everyone will find out anyway. Um, but yeah, last weekend, little recap. It was really, really good. Everyone absolutely loved it. The team smashed it, as you already saw. I've already watched the edit that George has done. Um, and she's, yeah, absolutely smashed it. She's getting very good at her videography. But the main thing for us is that our team always enjoy the show. And uh, they did. Like, they were all, this is all of their first season, apart from Sean. Um, and just the progress that they've all individually made has been absolutely incredible. You know, a couple of pro cards yesterday. That was a British final at the end of the day. And they all placed top three. Um, which is absolutely incredible. So over the moon for them, very, very happy. Did want to get it across that um, any time that our clients were on stage, I'd stepped away from the judging table. It probably didn't look like it because of the edits that G put together, but yeah, I wasn't allowed at the judging table. They even said that at the athletes meeting at the start of the show. So yeah, just wanted to get that across because we, uh, I, would, I wouldn't agree with that personally myself if I was sitting there on the table having any bearing or influence whilst my clients were competing. Uh, but on top of that, it wouldn't be fair to anyone else that was competing at that show either. So yeah, I had no say whatsoever uh, when our clients were on stage, okay? So it was a really good show to judge. There was a lot of great competitors there. And uh, what I love about it is seeing uh, the people competing at the regionals and then taking their feedback, because I try and give as many pe people feedback as I can. Because when I compete, I always really want feedback, like it's really important to me. So whenever they message me, I always give them as detailed feedback as I can and the ones that implemented it and came back at the finals leveled up like I, I love seeing that that was really really cool so yeah congratulations to everyone that competed at UK at finals not just our clients but many our clients <laughs> they smashed it so that is it that's going to wrap up the, that video so that is the end of the UK up season that was the British finals done we've still got a couple more shows um, actually we've got quite a few more shows we've got PCA to wrap up so that's why I'm competing tomorrow it's the last regional tomorrow I'm there because Sean's got to get his uh, PCA Finals invite, which is the following week, so that's next weekend. That'll be my last show of the season. Um, and then we still have an NFM show to go to, and we still have the Two Bros Natural shows to wrap up for the end of the season, essentially. Um, and that's going to finish in France at the IFBB Qualifier in December. So it's a very late season for those naturals. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. So yeah, next episode will be me competing at PCA Stafford along with Sean. Let's see if we can both get into those overalls. That'd be absolutely awesome to share the stage with him again. I haven't shared the stage with him and since last year when we did NFM. Um, and I always like sharing the stage with my clients. It's always really good fun. So yes, I shall see you in next week's episode, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Make sure that you do subscribe, especially if you follow bodybuilding, if you want to get into competing yourself, if you're quite new to it, or even if you're an experienced competitor and you just want to look and see what each federation has to offer or potentially look at how well some of the guys are doing, make sure you are subscribed because as you can see, we go to many different shows throughout the year. And even when show season starts next year, we'll be doing exactly the same thing. So it gives everyone a really good idea of, like I said, the standard at each show, but also what each federation has to offer. So going off of that, if anyone does want to compete next year or if anyone's looking for a prep coach feel free to reach out to us my show season finishes next weekend so i will be taking on more competitors as you've probably seen throughout this series i haven't really been advertising coaching just because i wanted to prioritize the team that we do have but now my show season has finished or is going to be finished next weekend i'll have more time to put into the team essentially and taking on more clients so if you're looking for prep coaching feel free to message us on Instagram or put the link for the socials down below. Georgia is also taking on prep clients herself now, bikini competitors, wellness competitors. So you've got the choice between her or myself. And uh, as you can see, we put a lot into this. So we give our clients everything that they possibly need to succeed. 
and that's why they succeed. So yes, once again, awesome work to the team, and I shall see you in next week's episode.